Hey, I'm Andy, and here's another idea worth sharing. We'll call this one wheelies. This is an exact replica drawing of a Boeing 777. He's the pilot. When a plane comes into land, it hits the tarmac at something like 280 k's an hour. Now the tyres on it have to go from 0 to 280 in a microsecond. That's why you see all the smoke. That must be incredibly tiresome on the tyres, right? Um, and I can't imagine they last that long uh, when they have to do that sort of acceleration so quickly. But I think there might be an easy fix for this. See, a plane that drops its landing gear looks just like that, several miles out from the runway. Out here it's doing you know, three or four hundred k's an hour and it's got all this distance until it actually lands. So out here when the wheels come out, this is a wheel by the way, obviously, if you had some sort of aerodynamic spoilers attached to the rim of the wheel that caught the air that's rushing by them and made the tyre spin. So when the tyre, when the, when the plane comes down to land here, it's doing you know, 270 k's an hour, and hopefully so are the tyres. So there's no wear on them anymore, they, they don't have to accelerate in a microsecond. They've got all this distance as it comes down to speed up and then land with no issue. Now these can't be very expensive to make, I'm talking like just some sort of plastic fins or carbon fibre or something uh, that, are, that are attached to the rim of the wheel. Now, they can't stick out too much because it's still got to fit in the underbody of the aircraft. But I think if you did that, um, you could extend the life of these tyres, I don't know, tenfold? And I think they cost something like three grand a pop. And one of these might have 10 of them. So there's 30 grand worth of rubber that's getting burnt up, going up in smoke every time the plane touches down. So if you could save all of that cost through something as simple as plastic fins, surely that's worth investigating.